Hello everybody, Devin here for a, um, a 2.30 a.m. video that I decided to record because I couldn't sleep. So, um, there's been a lot of questions about, you know, who I am and, you know, personal stuff so you guys can get to know me. And I have been telling myself, oh, Devin, you can just tell them all and it draw my life. But that's gonna take a while because I I just I want a better camera and I want it to be a good quality draw my life. So for now I'm just gonna tell you something. So one huge, huge, huge thing about me is that I have a disease. Since I think I was about two years old or something, I was little, I've been diagnosed with hemophilia type A severe. Now I know you're asking yourself this right now, you're like, Devin, uh, the hell is that? And then I would say, well, ghetto fabulous, I will tell you what that is. So basically, it's a blood disorder where my blood doesn't have a um, factor in it, which allows blood to like clot. So if I get a cut, you know how it like heals up really quick usually or something? Well, my blood's missing a protein to where um, it won't heal that quick. Like it, it just keeps like bleeding. There's a common misconception that I will bleed forever if I get a cut, which is, it's not, it's not true. That's not the case because I've been cut before and look, no blood. It's just that it takes a long, long time for me to heal and I have to, I have to take medicine for my hemophilia um, three times a week. So this is the box that I have of my medicine. It's called Advate. Oh, I feel like a, <laughs> I feel like I'm doing a makeup tutorial with medicine. So when I was little, I didn't have big enough veins to get shots in those, and I had to get a port, which is like a little like rubber cap thing that's put under your skin and connected to your body so that you can get medicine. So I have scars for my ports, and this is one right here, this line here, and then I have another one, a second one, it's smaller here. But now since I'm a big kid, I do it through the veins, through the veins. You can actually see a little, I did that today. And so here are my supplies. I have my box of medicine, I have a syringe, I have alcohol pads, a tourniquet, and a butterfly needle. And mind you, this is the smallest size of butterfly needle. I haven't upgraded yet because I just, <laughs> might as well have the smallest. You know, there's YOLO. I mean, I don't, I don't want a big needle in my arm. So technically I'm supposed to take a shot from my hemophilia three days a week, like Monday, Wednesday, Friday, or just like alternate. And I don't know, it's kind of complicated. I've never really stuck to the schedule that well. I'm a bad person. Um, <laughs> but bad news as of late, I just lost my medical insurance in Arizona. And so I literally have two things of my medicine left and then I have nothing. So I'm not sure, like I'm trying to get my medical insurance back. I never really learned how to handle all that stuff. So I'm gonna have to learn. <laughs> So yeah, that's the disease that I have, and um, like it's it's an issue sort of because I'm not allowed to play contact sports, so I never really played football. Um, I did play baseball, but it was really bad on my ankles. And I do dance, even though you know I don't know they don't want me to do hardcore physical stuff. But I'm just like you know what I'm gonna live my life. I don't even care. Like I do care obviously, but I'm gonna take care of myself the best way I can and just be happy. So with hemophilia, I get these things called bleeds, as I've known them to be called as, but it's where I get an injury and it like swells up and it like, anyways, let me show you, I have one today. Oh, wait, 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 let me tell you the story first. So, <laughs> so I'm really bony and stuff, obviously, and um, I dance, and so I do back rolls and I roll a girl off my back and all this crazy stuff, and I actually developed a bleed in my lower back, like on my spine, because it like hit the bone and stuff. And let me show you what it looks like. I don't know what it looks like. So I think you can see it, but it's this like, this like swollen area here. Yeah, that's not a very good example, but I get like nosebleeds in dry weather. I get um, ankle bleeds all the time. My right ankle is like, it's an issue because I've had so many bleeds and stuff. But yeah, so I live with the disease and it, I don't let it define me. Like I'm Devin. I don't like most people don't even know I have hemophilia because they keep it so like, you know, low key because it doesn't even matter. But now all of you guys know, let me know if you guys have a disease in the comments or if you have any questions about hemophilia, I'll answer as much as I can. And um, yeah, sharing, sharing a big um, thing about me and my life at 2.43 a.m. <laughs> so anyways, thank you guys for watching. Um, I just decided to get this out there. It wasn't gonna, I have like in my mind, I was thinking, oh, Devin, you're gonna use so many cool things to explain what hemophilia is and blah, 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 and have all these slideshow characteristics. Nope, that didn't happen. I just, I just was gonna tell ya. So good night or good morning or good day. I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.